Sac State's film program is producing some amazing graduates who are producing some amazing films. Have you seen Fruitville Station? Hello, my name is Ryan Kugler and I'm a filmmaker. I grew up about an hour away from Sac in the, in the East Bay area, um, in between Oakland and Richmond, California. Sacramento State, it was a good choice for me. It was a really exciting time. I just remember the energy around campus and, and being in a new place, um, with so many things going on. I was really excited. I really liked the environment. Um, and it was important to me to be close to my family, be somewhere where my family would be able to come see me play every weekend, and I could I could get home and still be an influence on my younger brothers' lives. Once I got to Sac State, uh, I knew that I that I that I wanted to be a, that I wanted to be a filmmaker. Um, I didn't know exactly how, how to go about how to go about that process though. One of the first things that I did was I went out and sought out this uh, this, this this guy named Dr. Pomo who I heard about. You know, meeting Dr. Pomo, meeting Stephen Buss. In many ways, they put me on that. They put me on that track. They put me on that right path, you know, to go and, and gave me the knowledge that I needed, and the tools that I needed to be to be successful. Uh, Dr. Pomo, what he really taught me was how to watch film. I spent tons of money actually here in this theater watching too many movies, and I discovered that I was, you know, I was a crazy. I'm, I'm a crazy cinephile to this day. They got to the point when I would bring my football teammates to his classes, and they, they started to take classes with Dr. Pomo. Next stop, Fruitvale Station. So the inception for, for the film that I, that I did last year called Fruitvale Station. Um, actually came from, from an incident that happened in the Bay Area, uh, where I'm from, and, and uh, it was an incident that affected everybody there. Um, an unarmed African-American young man named Oscar Grant was shot and killed while he was being detained by, um, by, by bar transit officers. A lot of Bay Area residents were there um, on the train, and they recorded with their video cameras and with their cell phones. When I first saw the footage, I couldn't help but see myself you know, in Oscar's shoes. He was the same age as me, 22 at the time. And, uh, you know, looked like he wore the same kind of clothes that I wore, and it you know, really affected me on an emotional level. What was really lost was the real breadth of the tragedy, the fact that this guy was a 22-year-old human being with pluses and minuses to, to, to his personality and to his life, um, but didn't make it home to the people who he mattered to, and that all lives matter to somebody. Um, th thank you guys so much for coming out tonight to check out the film that we worked really hard on. Um, it's a very special screening for me. I went to school in Sacramento State, and the first time I learned how to, how, to, how to touch a camera was at Sac State. The first time I learned how to use an Avid editing software was at Sac State. With Dr. Pomo and Professor Buss are the, two, of the, two of the biggest reasons why I'm standing in front of you guys right now. I'm Ryan Coogler, and I was made at Sac State.